Hey, what's up YouTube buddies? Welcome back to my channel and in case it's your first time ever coming across this space, Karibu Sana, you are welcome. My name is Mashi Pei. I create content on lifestyle and travel. To my returning subscribers, thank you so much for coming back. I see you all love and I really, really appreciate it. So it's currently 9 a.m. Today I have nothing major going on. Anyways, I wanted to come on here and start a new vlog because you people we are getting a new tv stand you all have always wanted to get a tv stand for the longest time and i don't know what really just caught me today and i was going through instagram pages that sell tv stands and i decided i'm actually going to buy a tv stand so yeah before that so i have already decided on what tv stand to go with after too much drama with myself i will explain later on in the video but before that as we wait for those guys to come honestly i still want to go back to bed i have like you can see my eyes <laughs> so yeah but before that i want to go uh to our rooftop and hang my clothes that i actually cleaned yesterday if you have watched uh, my yesterday's videos my yesterday my yesterday's video or the video before Yenye Eco, you've actually seen that I actually cleaned my clothes and I want to go and unhang them, fold them, and then go back to bed and sleep. So yeah, that's basically going to be it. So I'll take you guys along with me uh, as we wait for that TV stand to come and we see how it looks like and then I'll plug you guys with the exact page. Love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and one, yeah, yeah. done organizing my clothes are done uh, the organization yesterday but I had some laundry that I'd cleaned you've seen I folded them and then placed them to their respective places so I think everything looks a little bit more organized now than it was actually before so right now I'm going back to bed to get a little bit of sleep because I feel sleepy and then I'll wake up communicate with the TV stand guys and then I'll keep you guys updated Hello you guys, so a quick update, the TV stand guys have just called me and I'm so excited you all because at first I thought, I thought you people that I've actually been conned one more time. Anyways, I haven't, I believe so, but I'll believe my eyes once I see the TV stand because you people, Akimimi Nairobi has shown me Maneno. Anyways, when they get here, I'll show you guys everything. So I wanted to quickly take a shower because I was sleeping. We didn't have school today, so I haven't gone to school. I haven't basically done anything. I've actually been having like rest days recently because the past two weeks have been so overwhelming. Like everything has been so fast. I haven't been able to sleep well, so I've been having like some rest days. Resume school tomorrow, so I think by tomorrow I'll be okay. So before anything else, uh, I want to quickly take some juice because I'm a little bit hungry and then go downstairs and see if I can be able to pick them up because they said they were like I think a minute away so I think by now they are actually here I'm still waiting for their call I told them to call me when they get exactly here because I gave them like better directions to exactly where I live so I'll take you guys with me and then pick up the TV stand I hope they bring it upstairs with me but even if they don't I think then our get guy will help me do it or maybe our caretaker and then we'll see the final look thank you so much you all for actually watching my videos always there's so much love in my previous video you guys thank you so so much please subscribe you all Aki I really really appreciate it and I love you guys so so much you guys I'm wearing pajamas and it's like I think 12 p.m. you all I'm a joker Hello, hi. Hey, you 
you guys so the tv stand is finally here and you people crafty kenya are so legit check them out on instagram they are ke crafty or are they crafty ke whatever check them on instagram i'll leave a link to their description i'll leave i'll leave a link to their instagram page on my description box and then i'll confirm the names well and then plug you guys in a better way so quickly let me take you through a short tour of this tv stand because i know already you people are seeing the whole thing but anyways we have to do it so you have this uh, storage segment, I'll call it that, or is it a cabinet or a compartment? I don't know what to exactly call it. And then you have these particular two spaces. I know already kituenye nataka kueka hapo. Hey, you guys, I want to put some cute deco books in here. And then I think they actually look so pretty. And then you have another extra storage uh, compartment over there because i'm pretty sure i'll just store some stuffs over there so that's basically it and then uh huko nyuma you realize they have some i think these wires kupitisha wires the tv in case you have to connect with whatever things over here and then yeah they also have this cute ascent mustard line over here so initially this was not the tv stand that i wanted i'm going to tell you guys guys that story in a moment and then they have are they metallic oh they're actually mbao i was thinking they are metallic emma i don't know not sure uh so yeah they have those cute two legs they're also mustard in color mustard is such a cute color i don't really hate mustard as such but my preference was like wood in the first place and then i also didn't want it to have uh this mustard ascent line and then i was planning on having it have handles but i actually think now that i've seen this one i actually prefer it like that because look at that anyways so that's basically the whole thing that's how it looks i'm going to decorate this specific tv stand with you guys in uh video that will be up maybe or maybe not maybe next week i think and then so down here were plants like my plants i have that aloe plant and this snake plant you people are my snake plant okay guy i don't know nani alikanyaga apa ikapasuka i've actually been trying to maintain maintain it like i don't see it actually coming back to life and I'd requested you people to give me an idea of what I will do to it in the Irudi form. Lakini sasa nyinyi ata ham come through books over there. So I think I'm going to get, finally, I've been dreaming of getting cute pots. So I think it's finally time for me to actually get very cute pots to place on top of this TV stand. I'm already thinking of, no, let me not spoil it. Mm, let me not be sneaky. I'll give you guys, I'll show you guys the final decoration after we actually get to do it and then something else that hmm, i'm seeing is an is an error is the way this tv was actually mounted so if you actually notice it's like it has moved yani ime song hivi sana kuliko the tv stand if i was in a position to i would have moved it to a little bit be in a central position but i don't think i am willing to to spend my money on having it moved but what i think i'm going to do sasa is cable management i already know a specific guy from instagram that i'm going to work with on that one so yeah that's basically going to be it and then something else that i've had to do is push this specific seat kiasi hivi you can tell there was enough storage there that i'm actually planning on placing a very tall kaplan so yeah we've had to push it a little bit to create some space yakusonga hivi so that we actually also get space to open there so in case you are wondering why everything looks like this i was just trying to fix everything to be okay because i have a small space and then when you have a small space you have to really just squeeze everything to fit so i'm going to show you guys real quick what exactly my living room looks like as per now we still have a lot to do but anyways we celebrate small wins this living room has a lot that needs to be done now anyways uh my system study area books tv stand plans so i'm going to actually the way i've told you guys i'm going to do a better decoration of the tv stand so kindly ignore everything that is happening right now and then 
moving to that area are my TV, moving to that area my throw blanket, throw pillows, my seat, and then curtains. Oh, I actually have this cute thing that I got from Think Twice. I don't know what exactly it is, but I love something that is just like furry furry, so I don't know. I just picked it because I thought it was kind of like matching my theme because I love this color so so much so yeah I'll find somewhere to actually place it uh, yeah I'll find somewhere to actually place it so yeah uh, my seat over there cut hands kamakawida plug usually and then moving to this side my two seater seat and then through pillows and then you exit so that's basically what everything currently looks like looks like if you want a detailed house tour then scroll down on my channel and you'll find the exact wall house tour you people so you people we have come to the end of this video and you guys if you want a tv stand please go to instagram and check crafty ke follow them you can always dm them they are so fast their customer service is so nice the guys uh their communication is so nice but for a minute <laughs> For a minute, I actually think I was conned, but I think they were just a little bit busy because after I made the payment, I called, I called, I called for like five times and then no one was speaking, but they called me back. I actually, hmm, I think you people don't blame me. I actually initiated a reversal of my transaction because you guys, Aki Mimi Nairobi, what were my Nesha Mambo? So Aki, I initiated a transaction and then when they brought the TV stand, they actually called me when they were on their way and asked me about it i explained the situation to them well and then they they said the person that had that that line when i was calling was not on duty that specific day and that was the reason why they were not picking up so you guys they are legit you can always reach out to them i'm actually now thinking i wish i actually waited for my specific for the specific tv that i wanted i've shown you guys what i wanted already wooden legs uh generally white without the, the mustard accent and then with white handles but i actually think i love this one as well so i'm not complaining i think this was actually my first this was actually what I wanted from the beginning, 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 Kabisa. So yeah, I'm still going to work with it. In the case of anything, Ata Ikini Bosana, I can actually just paint the whole thing white. So you guys, I was telling you a story of what actually happened. After I made my transactions, I've told you guys I called the guy and then he wasn't speaking. I initiated the transaction. So when they explained to me, uh, I told them they can decline the the reversal that I had initiated because I was sure Safaricom was going to definitely call them and then Safaricom had told me they were going to reverse the money in 48 sorry within 72 hours and then I told them if they are not okay with that we can actually call Safaricom with them and then tell them to actually cancel the reversal while they are here but they were really nice enough to actually tell me no they're going to tell the person that deals with their payments to actually just decline the decline the, the the reversal request that i had met because i was so sure safaricom will also call them so that's basically it you people they are legit i've actually seen they have very cute mirrors i'm going to get a mirror from them i think their mirrors are so huge and they go for nine thousand i think yeah they also have very cute bookshelves they have a wide variety of tv stands so that's basically it you guys if you want to buy a tv stand i have plugged you guys with the best People, they are so affordable. This specific TV stand goes for 13,000 Kenyan shillings. And then when you are within Nairobi, they deliver for they deliver for free. So for me, they actually told me that I am out of Nairobi, which makes sense because I live like, I don't know how to say, I live like uh, Nairobi, Imeisha, Pako, Imjoy, Papa, and then another county begins but they were fair enough to actually so delivery fee was 500 shillings and they were good enough to only have it delivered for 300 shillings so yeah you can actually talk to them they're very nice you people you can actually talk to them ask them for maybe a price deduction i think i'm not sure but i think with business it's always about negotiating and all that so yeah i'll see you guys on my next video thank you so much for watching till the end please subscribe and i'll see you guys on my next bye bye